with the final episode of the Book of Boba Fett about to drop, I thought we'd have a little bit of fun here on the channel and uh, share a little bit of my speculations of what I think we might see in this episode. Hey everyone, it's Rev Kev. Welcome back to the channel. Just thank you so much for being here and being a part of the community. It really means a lot to me when you like and comment. And a big shout out to my members. It really means a lot that you support the channel and the work that I'm doing out in the community uh, through membership here on YouTube. So the final episode of the book of Boba Fett is about to drop. And I have a lot of crazy cats running around in my head. A lot of crazy theories. Now, none of this comes from any kind of <laughs> source at Lucasfilm or anything like that. This is just me geeking out a little bit and have a number of speculations about what we can expect. So here are my five big things that I'm expecting to see in this final episode. And these are in no particular order, but uh, let's hit it. So coming in at number five, there will be a mention of Grand Admiral Thrawn. Again, I don't think we will see him. I don't think there'll be a glimpse of him. But just like how we had in The Mandalorian, I think there will be another name drop on Grand Animal Thrawn. As it, by all indication, it seems like that's what they're building up to is some kind of Thrawn type of event. So I think we're going to get a drop, a mention, a comment about the Grand Admiral. Coming in at number four, I think we're going to see Han Solo. I think they just can't stay away from the nostalgia berries and just keep jangling those keys in front of us and just keep giving us, you know, more of the same. And so I think we are going to get a deep faked younger Harrison Ford, uh, de aged Harrison Ford, making an appearance in the final episode of the book of Boba Fett. No clue what he's going to do in it. Is he already going to be a deadbeat by this point? I don't think. No. According to the timeline now, he wouldn't be a deadbeat yet because they didn't give up Kylo you know, or Ben Solo to Luke yet. So maybe he's there working with the New Republic trying to uh, you know, bring some order to that part of the galaxy. Who knows? But I think he's going to show up. Number three, and this is a big one. I think Boba Fett dies. <laughs> Again, not a spoiler. I've got no information. This is just my speculation. I think they're going to kill him. I don't think they have any clue what to do with him. Part of me originally was thinking that he's going to join the Mandalorian and help the Mandalorian rebuild Mandalore and all of that, but uh, just doesn't seem to fit with the character as they have made him now. I think he's going to die at the end of this episode. Now, the death of Boba is going to leave a void in the underworld of Tatooine. And as we've been seeing with the Dave Filoni stuff, you know, on Disney Plus, they love bringing back Clone Wars characters. So I think we will get Jabba the Hutt's son coming back. So that's my number two in my countdown here. We're going to get Jabba the Hutt's son coming back to take over after his father to actually be the new crime boss of Tatooine. And who knows, maybe they'll do some kind of touchy-feely kind of spin on it. And it's not that he's going to be a crime boss, but he's actually going to be a good boss. And he's going to create, you know, employment and all these wonderful things for the people of Tatooine. And he's going to be a benevolent leader. <laughs> who knows? But I think he's coming back because that's just what they keep doing, bringing back Clone Wars characters. And then finally, for number one, I think because of the death of Boba Fett, and Jabba's son coming in. Now we got this character, Fennec Sand, who doesn't have anything to do. So she is going to join up with the Mandalorian and uh, help him become the leader of Mandalore. I think uh, she's a pretty popular character and um, kind of keeping her in a sideline type of story arc doesn't make any sense. They're going to move her into something bigger and more important. And so she is going to jump back into the Mandalorian series. So those are my predictions for the finale of the Book of Boba Fett. 
Would love to know what you think about these ideas in the comment section, and I'd love to know what you think we can expect to see from this final season. Put those down in the comments as well. And then, of course, we'll have to make another video after the episode comes out to see how much we were right. <laughs> and we'll discuss that then. Again, thank you so much for taking the time to be here as part of the community on the channel. Again, it means so much to me. And I uh, just really hope that you have a great day. Look forward to seeing you back here again real soon. God bless you and take care. Thank you.